Hi there! How is going? Getting ready again for the next project with our 3D pen? Here we are. Let's turn on our 3D pen and uh, I will give you a pip in what we are going to do today. We are going to use uh, this one. I guess everyone has around the house uh, some of this. Uh, any size will be good. And actually I will show you for example first to use the small one that I guess are more common and then you can do this one a bookmark I really like it my son love it I put it this morning in his advent calendar and actually couldn't choose which one of the two but <laughs> I will show you both of them so let's see how it's going for example first I want to just to show you how easy it is to connect remember to put a lower speed in uh, your 3d pen because it will be easier to manage you put the back side so the flat uh, the flat part and then you will put positioning this part of the clip and then simply we will do this super easy right if you want to flatten this part instead of touching, that is something that sometimes I do, I will just press it on my transparent foil. Oh, let me move my monkey. And just leave it a little bit. In the meanwhile, let's start uh, the real project of today. That will be this uh, um, snowman. So if you would like to have the template uh, and if you need the basic of the 3D pen, remember you can just uh, go on my website and search for my Skillshare class where you will get all the basic and many uh, free tips uh, and suggestions but also these uh, templates uh, that you can use to prepare Christmas project. Let's start! This one is ready and as you can see you could just put it in a page like this uh, and it's there isn't it cute already done and it's also so small that i guess that you could even add it uh, as a small gift uh, inside uh, your christmas card so you can write your message uh, and you can add this one as a surprise uh, small surprise uh. i think this one will be perfect for example for a classmate at school as you can see it's not so big and it's very light uh, as if nothing is inside so let me know what do you think if you have other idea on how to use it i just wanted to tell you that i put this snowflakes there in the template also because i think it's unbelievable good to do not lose uh, uh, filaments uh, while you're changing the colors because it's so easy and uh, even if it's not white or like in this case it will take still the part of the black that was the previous color inside then it will become white so I think it's perfect to practice with the 3D pen and in the meanwhile you're not feeling that you're losing your work and your filament because this will happen anyway I mean you will have to wait for the the, the new color to come out clear before using it, your real project right so as you can see when i started it was like this blackish then it become more grayish and then finally is the white that i want so in the meanwhile that i i practice with this template i'm ready with the real color i wanted and at the end i will still have this one for example this one you can check i started it was during a changement between a white and a red or this one, it was exactly the opposite. I changed between red, actually maybe it was orange, or red or orange, and then it became white. So it is fun and you will collect anyway snowflakes that are always usable <laughs> when you want to do uh, during Christmas time. Anyway, let's go ahead. In some kit of the 3D pen, you might have uh, 
this one that is like a spatula to remove it like this and it's super fast as you can see but you can remove it also by hand in this side your project will be like this in this part is much more shiny you can choose the part that you like the most okay ready to connect it as I told you you can press it like this uh, to flatten it a little bit more and in the meanwhile that this one is getting ready I just want to show you some other design that I did from my template so these are two that we already saw but uh, if you want for example to surprise your mother grandmother and auntie i think this one is super cute for christmas and um, it's not so bad also in the back side it's easy to put as you can see and um, for example you can put a christmas tree and you can even use more of them especially like in a book of this one you have uh, many parts that you want to keep note oh my gosh I, I love this page i always love to see eric carlo at work okay anyway this one is another topic and so let's see if it is ready it is ready wow super ready put it here and look it works as magic and i think it's so much fun to see your bookmark like this what do you think I would love to see your project if you draw along with me and uh, please remember to tag me and uh, see you tomorrow for another idea. Bye!